What's up, TNJ family? We are back with another video after a month. It's not my fault, but we're here, okay? So he still, he still ain't learned his lesson about trying your husband. What? I just feel like it's a, it's just been so. Try much. Jesus, not me. Not my Lord and Savior. We've been really busy. And we just disconnected, you know? We haven't posted, well, we've been posting more on Instagram, but we haven't posted stories as much, which is like our day-to-day. -day. And we haven't posted a lot of YouTube videos, but we are back to just let you guys know what we've been doing. And uh, to tell you we missed you. Yeah. We do miss you guys. Don't ever feel like we're neglecting you or anything like that. It's just, like Terrell said, we lead really, really, really busy lives. So when you say you miss them, do you mean like the camera we talking to? No, like I know I'm talking to them, the audience. Okay. The audience. Yeah. Ooh, that's a different word. I thought y'all were family. So you just gonna throw me under the bus? No shade. I didn't say it. He did. Comment what you think. Comment how you feel about it. You know, Tara check. already said that, you know, he feel like y'all love me more, so. Some days y'all show a little favoritism. But anyway, they're working on our pool, which is going on like, who knows, 20 weeks at this point. More to come on that. Um, so they're gonna be walking back. <laughs> <laughs> They're gonna be walking back and forth. As you guys can see from the title, we did something super amazing for our team. Now, if you don't know, I'm gonna make him insert clips of, um, look, yeah, he told me not to do this. I'm gonna make him insert photos of each one of our team members, including himself, and he hates <laughs> taking pictures of himself, um, but I took a few, so maybe he'll include those. So, we have Ben, which is our videographer and photographer. He takes all of our videos and photos. We have Shauna, which you guys know, which is the kid's nanny, and then we have Howard, which is our assistant. They work hard just like we do, so we decided that we were gonna take them on a surprise trip to doom, 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 doom. Jamaica, Yaman. Yeah, Yaman. Yeah, you know what? I didn't know it was spelled like that until we got there. Yeah. Y. -A. Yeah, yeah. And it's Y A H. Yeah. You didn't even know. No, I did. You I said I saw it. I mean, I forgot the H. Yeah, man. But anyways, so it's we not did that. Yeah, it's yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Um, I'm full of jerk chicken because I feel like that's all I ate. I'm full of pork chops and rice. You know, you eat a pig wherever you go. Mm-hmm. We went to an all-inclusive resort. Um, the flight wasn't that long. Um, I was very quick. We had a direct flight. Anyways, we got to Jamaica. It was our first time. We're it was actually everyone's first time. Everyone's first time. We're all spoiled with all-inclusive now, which is the best, by the way. Maybe I should be a travel blogger. Um, you don't have to worry about food and, and certain Drinks, things like that. Because um, some of us drink more than others. Ben. <clears throat> <laughs> I feel like everybody had a chance to get loose um, and loosen up when I say get loose. We stayed at the Hyatt Ziva and I will say that we were a bit skeptical about it because we, they had mixed reviews on YouTube. We got a chance to go look at other people's reviews about it. They said it was like, it seemed boring in mm -hmm. some areas cause it's an adult side and then it's like a family side. So we stayed on the family side of course, cause we had the kids. Late at night, the team got a chance to go over to the adult side, but it was pretty, it was just like chill. It wasn't much going on. It was kind of dated. Like the insides didn't really have like, a lot. It wasn't like our Turks and Caicos and Dominican Republic trips. Let me say that. Yeah. The one thing that I will say about it being a little more on the reserve side was that I felt very comfortable from a COVID perspective. Because um, nobody like, was there. Right. I feel like it was very spaced apart. Actually, Jamaica is very clean when it comes to COVID because y'all make us sanitize like 50, 11 times before we even leave the airport. It was very different from our Mexico trip where it was just jam packed. We didn't even tell them that we went to Mexico. We went to Mexico. So <laughs> we went to Cabo different. for the first time and we went to the Hard Rock Hotel and it was packed. Like packed. it was like so many people. So this was like the pools was pretty empty. We had space for like the kids to swim and I, I like that. So I yeah. thought it was pretty cool. Because the resort didn't really have a ton of activities, we, we went on two excursions. Um, when Jarvis and I went to Cabo, I'm in love with dolphins. Literally almost every city that we go to, if you guys haven't figured out, we go to the aquarium or I want to go like swim with dolphins. All my animal lovers out there that's going to bash me for it, save it. The kids, when we were in Cabo, probably like two weeks before, they saw the videos of Jarvis and I swimming with dolphins, so we promised them that we would take them. So we got a chance to do that. That was pretty fun, aside from us getting rained on the entire time. It was cold, I'm not going to lie. It was cold for me. And it was definitely cold for Ashton too because he let us know it's time to get out. But I will say the most enjoyable part of it for us as parents was Aria. Aria 
lived her best life. Yeah. Like she was the first to volunteer to go swim out by herself to let the dolphin come interact with her. It was amazing. And then we look over and Ben Howard and Shauna are laughing. Getting thrown like by dolphins. They're getting thrown by the dolphins. Like they were just having a really amazing trip and amazing time um, to get to experience. And I feel like for us, that's what we wanted. We wanted to give them an experience to show our appreciation because, you know, while we work hard as well, they are behind the scenes that you guys don't often get to see doing a lot of the leg work too. So we really wanted it to be a trip that they would enjoy as well. And it seemed like they had a blast. Right, Ben? Yes. <laughs> we also went um, rafting. So on bamboo rafts, it was called Martha Bay, I think. Mm -hmm. Bray? I don't know. But anyway, we went rafting. It started to drizzle a little bit, but that's where we got bit by mosquitoes. Which I'm still itching. We got bit by so many mosquitoes, man. It was ridiculous. But that was like relaxing. I probably would have saved my money. I guess it would be like more romantic. But Jarvis and I didn't get to ride together. So you can only have either two adults and one child. So we both had to split up. Um, and we wrote it separately. Jari's See, had a good, a good I, guy. I feel like I would have enjoyed it even without the guy. I love stuff like that. And, but my guy did make it mm -hmm. really amazing because he got to explain to me like the history of the area. And then also we talked a lot about, you know, Jamaica in itself and like what goes on in the country and the differences between like the United States and Jamaica and other countries. And I learned a lot. And I think I gained a lot of appreciation for the people in Jamaica um, and all of the things that you guys have to go through. Which, by the way, we have a ton of like followers from Jamaica. So shout out to you guys. We didn't announce we were there, so don't hate us. And then when we posted the picture, we were already back. So everybody was just like, oh my goodness, like come see me. I want to see you. Like y'all are in my city. It wasn't about, you know, us going there. It was literally to say thank you to our team. And we didn't want it to be about work and stuff. So we got to go to the pool. Mm -hmm. We did like the hot tub thing. We got to eat. They the had kids like had a dance party. They did. They got to go on stage and do some dance. But really, that was it. Like it was just chill. It rained two of the days, which was oh, they were also on lockdown too. So and we didn't know that. Yeah, Jamaica was on lockdown Monday, Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday. We got there on Monday, and then so we couldn't go anywhere Monday and Tuesday. And we were supposed to do zip lining and ATVs, um, but that was obviously canceled. Um, and then we only had Wednesday and Thursday to really do anything. So that's why we couldn't do a whole lot. But in itself, like I would say it was still an amazing trip because I think for me, I got to really get to know the team in like an intimate way um, that we had not gotten to really, really know each other um, before. And I so if like your bosses important. ain't taking y'all on trips like that, <laughs> quit. Come work for, I'm not hiring. I'm just kidding. Um, <laughs> <laughs> look, don't quit your job. Look, stop the email that you were typing midway. Don't do nothing crazy because I can't support you. No, I think it was an amazing trip. Now, what I will say, it wasn't all peaches and cream. Look, we're going to say this. Jamaica is not the most LGBTQ friendly. Now, the resort wasn't terrible, but it was some instances where we kind of got some side eyes. And you know why? Let me tell you. L let me tell y'all a funny story on why I was so subconscious, too. I went to the nail salon. I go to the same nail salon all the time. I get my nails done. I got my feet done. And she was just like, oh, why don't you try something different? Child, do you know I went this whole week with my nails pink? Terrell was already borderline pink on his fingernails anyway. My fingernails to... are cute. I ain't gotta get it. I gotta go again. But everybody come for me on my fingernails. Everybody but I don't gotta... understand why you need to put like a pink tint on it. Try is. Why you don't worry about your brown fingernails? My fingernails are not brown, baby. They not, who's they better? Comment, Terrell or Jarius, which ones are better? They are clear. Jarius, they gonna like mine better. Terrell, no, they're not. Everywhere, you know nobody comments that they like your nails. You have not gotten one compliment. People always comment on my nails. Who? If you have ever commented and said something about my nails, please tell Guys, me. it's about me. Because people have definitely said that on mine. She didn't, she didn't give me, anyway, it's again, I'll say So outside of that, like, I just think we would have needed to choose like maybe a better resort. Like we probably would have did a sandals. And then I just feel like y'all need like a mall. Now, I don't know if somebody lied to us, but we couldn't find a mall to go shopping. Um, it was like these outdoor like situations and that's not my vibe, but you know comment Maybe we was in the wrong area. So we went to Montego Bay So we heard people say you should try Ocho's Rios Negro Kingston like any of our Jamaican I think I, would, out there. I think I would pick Kingston to go to next just because it's more of a you. city I was asking them and you cut me off 
Sorry, babe. I think I would pick Ken and you're Kingston. Keep going. But yeah, because it's more of a developed city, and I feel like if we could just go to the beach, you know, and, Some things and don't stay change, there, uh, and then still be able to go to the city and stuff, I think that would be perfect. Yeah, sure. But overall, it was a it was a pretty good. Yeah, trip. now you ain't out got nothing to say. Now you ain't out of ten. What you heard me it? about to say uh, out of ten, and now you want to say it. No, no, no. I'm gonna say it. So out of ten, I would give it a six. I give it a five, and let me tell you why I no, give it a Jay, five. No, Jay, nobody want to know why you give it a five. I think overall, I'm gonna give it a five. Uh, look, Howard here. Howard, what would you give it? A nine. A nine? Uh-huh. He's uncultured, Ben. I'm actually joking. I'm not going to give it a five. I would actually agree with Tara. I would give it a six or seven simply because I wanted a little bit more liveliness from the people. Shauna. Yeah. Okay, you're on our YouTube video, okay? I'm in your YouTube video? Yeah. You're on what? You're, you're talking. Okay, rate Jamaica one out of ten. Um, eight and a half. See, I told y'all her and Howard was lit, baby. Because mm-hmm. Howard said a nine. Okay. Surprising to me, but um, everything else was pretty good. Thanks, Shana. I love you. Love you. Okay. That's exactly <laughs> what I just said. I feel I just wanted a little bit more they like did. welcomeness yeah. from the people. But they were they were nice. It was just it was hit or miss. Yeah. So, but anyway, that's our Jamaica trip. We have like three more trips coming up. We hope to blog it. Maybe Jarvis mm-hmm. don't be want to work when we go, but. No, no I but feel this, like is, next, this is that, why, though. Oh my no, God. no, 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 no. Hear me out. Hear me out. This is why. You guys, we've been on YouTube since 2018, and we've been public since 2016. And I feel like, kind of like how Beyonce is, is like you give so much to, you get to a point to where you just want to have some things for yourself. And me, personally, I feel like we've worked hard enough to where we can take some time to well, do some things like, for ourselves. We've done like three vacations without them knowing, so I think that they've missed a lot. And then we leave next week. But with that said, we love you guys so much. Comment where you think we're going next. Let's see if y'all can guess our next vacations without us telling you. Tell us where you think we're going. Comment and let us know about the, you know, if you've ever been to Jamaica, if you live there. What did we do wrong? Yeah. What did we do wrong? What did we miss? Like, what should we give it another chance? Should we go again? And we promise to give you guys a video soon. We got some tea to tell y'all. As always. About... One of the things that y'all told us about and we didn't listen. But we love you guys so much. And until next time. Bye. Bye. You talk too much. I hate doing videos with you. I hate doing sit downs with you. Move. You be trying, you know what, when you can't think of stuff, you be trying to steal my stuff. Tara, I was trying to steal your stuff. Yes. When what you what can't, I tried to steal? No, get off of me. What when I you tried to steal? When you can't think of stuff, you, you try to steal my lines, and then and then you be having the people think, oh, Tara, I'm always cutting them off. No, because it's my thought. <laughs> I can't it's borrow thought. your thought? No, Darius. Your thoughts are my thoughts. That's your problem, though. Get me out of here. <laughs> your thoughts I'm are so my thoughts. I'm so professional. Look how I can de-mic myself. You know what? Excuse me. No, don't, ouch! I'm gonna take my